Oh baby, what is up? It is finally time to hit the road to North Carolina on a two day fishing trip. As you can see, the weather is absolutely terrible, but I've got my vlog camera, I've got the GoPro, I've got plenty of batteries, I've got all my chargers, and I'm already being told that when as soon as the weather clears up tomorrow, we're gonna hit the water. So I can't wait. We're gonna get one, if not two videos out of this weekend. I'm so excited, but because of the weather, I don't know how much footage I'm gonna get on the actual drive up. AMS is gonna be my co-pilot, um, so we might be able to get some, but we'll see. So excited to finally be catching some fish for you guys right here on the vlog. Let's go. Are you recording already? Yo, we finally made it to North Carolina, and we were gonna to go to Jersey Mike's, and 45 minutes before they closed, they had all the chairs up on the tables, and we didn't wanna walk in and be those people, but at the same time, like, what up, Jersey Mike's? Uh, so we stopped here at Smithfield's Chicken and Barbecue. Forgot we weren't in South Carolina anymore, and all of their sauces are like vinegar based. What do you think, babe? No. Nah, it's a no go for us, but you know what? The service in there was awesome. Smithfield's Chicken and Barbecue. If you like vinegar based barbecue, hit it up. We didn't, we still ate the food, and everybody was super polite there. So we're about to hit the road, get to our destination, and we'll check back in. Yo, we made it to uh, Uncle Curtis's house, and it's what time? 11.50. It's midnight, gotta be up at 6.30, trying to meet up around 7 uh, to go fishing as long as the weather is good. Got all the batteries over here charging, and I feel like I've been driving all day, so I'm gonna crash, and can't wait to go get some fish tomorrow. Yo, what's up, day one, about to hit the water. Here's our guide over here. Day one is done. We finally caught a fish. Almost didn't get it on cam though. Uh, what, I wasn't in looping mode on the GoPro yet. So as soon as I set the hook, I was like, oh, gotta record, hit record. I'm trying to be quiet, everybody's asleep. Um, but gotta be up at 6 a.m. We're gonna go try to hit the water again tomorrow. Unfortunately, it's been so windy here. The water levels are so low, especially around the boat ramp. So we might not even be able to get back out on there, but we're gonna try our best. Hopefully get some more stuff for you guys. What's up y'all, it's day two. About to try to hit the water if the ramps have enough water on them. Got the full coveralls on. It's like 30 degrees outside. Uh, but hey, like I said, we're gonna try to get it today. Hopefully get some really great GoPro footage for you guys.
right, we jumped off the water. Uh, we caught two fish. Super fast off the jump, Curtis and our guy James also caught one. I'm gonna link his information down in the description. If you're ever around New Bern, definitely hit him up. Super great guy, super knowledgeable. Had a really great time talking and meeting him today. Uh, but obviously in the video you'll see Curtis's uh, striper he caught. Had some bites, too slow on setting the hook, and I've been told that bass fishing is a lot different in how you set the hook. I figure I'll let those cars go by real quick. Um, I don't know how much footage I'm gonna get on the way home, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video of me taking this trip here to New Bern, spending a couple days fishing. If you like the content, don't forget to hit subscribe. We're at like 220 something at the time I'm filming this, and I'm super excited about this YouTube channel this year. Also, after talking with Uncle Curtis, it uh, looks like in a couple months we're gonna be out here doing some turkey hunting and doing some filming for them, as well as hunting myself. So, can't wait to share some of that content with you guys as well. I'm pretty excited about the future of this channel, and I hope you guys are too. So, I'll see you real soon. Thank you guys so much.